You changed my life. Hello, how are you today? I hope you're doing fine. Are you ready to learn science stuff? Great! But before we start our lesson, I want you to prepare yourself as well as your material necessary for your study. Try to find a nice and comfortable place inside your home where you can focus with our lesson. For this week's lesson, we're going to answer three questions. Number one, what is oxygen? What is heat? Number two, how does the presence and absence of heat affects humans, material, and our environment? Number three, what are the examples in which oxygen is present or absent? What is heat? Heat, it is produced when energy is transformed. Sun is the main source of heat. Heat energy, also called as thermal energy, is produced from the temperature of heated material. How to measure heat? Thermometer, it is a device used to measure the temperature of an object. As you can see in the illustration, we have different kinds of thermometer used to measure the temperature of an object. How does the presence and absence of heat affect humans, materials, and our environment? For humans and animals, the presence of heat can cause chemical change when the composition of a product is altered. Digestion is a process wherein digested food is metabolized or used up in the body by combining with oxygen. This process is irreversible. For a material, the presence of heat might change the state of a material. For example, the ice melts when it is exposed under room temperature, from solid state to liquid state. Pollution is also another factor that may contribute to the increase in temperature of our planet. It can contaminate water, air, and soil that may harm living organisms. It is also one of the reasons why there is a rapid increase in the temperature of our planet each year. The presence of heat may cause increase in the temperature of a planet. If not controlled immediately, it may lead to global warming. Global warming, it occurs when carbon dioxide and other pollutants and greenhouse gases trap in the atmosphere. What is oxygen? Oxygen, it is a life-supporting component of the air for humans and animals. It is the end product of photosynthesis in the production of food for plants. Photosynthesis, it is the process in which plants manufacture their own food with the help of sunlight, carbon dioxide, and water. The plants release oxygen as their end product which is essential to us humans and animals to sustain life. We have here an illustration that shows how oxygen cycle takes place. What are the examples in which oxygen is present? Combustion, it is the scientific term for burning. It needs heat, fuel, and oxygen to happen. Combustion will not occur if one of the three elements is missing. Rusting, is formed when iron reacts with oxygen in the presence of water or air moisture. To minimize rusting, we need to cover up the surface of a metal object like iron. What are the examples in which oxygen is absent? Decomposition. It is a continuous natural process which starts immediately after death and causes the organic substance of a body to break down into much simpler form of matter. Why do we need to know all these things about heat and oxygen? We need to know the ideas about heat and oxygen because it sustains life. Life here on earth will not continue if one of these is missing. Chemical change caused by heat is irreversible. I hope you learned a lot from our today's lesson. See you again in our next one. Bye!